Hey, welcome back to the show. Dylan Blackoff. I am filling in for him today, and we are back to tell you about an incredible production, the production called Burn at the Ottawa Little Theater. And, uh, you know, uh, as a volunteer theater, I've been to many, many productions. It is absolutely incredible what they have put on. It's, it's professional theater right here in Ottawa, put on by volunteers. And I'm joined by the playwright, John Muggleton, and cast member Carolyn Cote. Welcome, guys. Great Thank to see you. you. It's like a you. reunion. I know. I haven't I, seen you guys yeah. in so long. I know. It's, it's been great, great to see you. Uh, John, I want you to talk a little bit, first of all, about the Ottawa Little Theatre, because, mm -hmm. you know, I did mention, I mean, you're talking about some of the highest quality. I've seen better productions there than I have in, you know, some of the professional productions put yeah. on. What do you think that is? I mean, the volunteers are obviously passionate. Right? Well, I mean, OLT's been around for 107 years. It's the longest-running theatre in Canada. Um, and, you know, there's a, a volunteer base of 500 people that really that love that theater yeah. and I think a lot of times the difference between community theater and professional theater we're getting paid is community theater people do it because they love it right. and they get invested in it and they get proud of their production and they you know they just love putting it on and they put so much care into it um, and I think the standard over the years has been built so high that you know every production going into is like okay we have to match that we have right. to match that or even better you know there's a yeah I think we see the same with community television right I yeah. think there's some parallels to, totally, to those you know? two yeah. uh, you know you mentioned you mentioned you know invested in it obviously you're very invested in this production because you wrote Burn tell me a little I bit about this did production. yeah Burn's been done uh, you know across Canada yeah. it's, it's doing well and it's really amazing that they selected it for this season. Uh, my mom acted at OLT in the 50s, and of course, I, in the 90s, I acted yeah. there. And, uh, and my daughter, who's three and a half, was in a production, believe it or not. So, really? you know, I'm the only person that's sort of three generations of, of OLT stuff, so I'm cool. very proud to have my play done there. And it's only the second time that a person has had a play produced that lives in Ottawa. Yeah. So I'm proud of that, and uh, just to see it on that stage is amazing. Carolyn, how would you do, how would you describe this this play to people? Okay, so first off, it's lots of fun, very creepy, lots of spooky twists and turns. It's basically <laughs> the story of three friends, okay. um, and I play one of the friends whose name is Sam, and we're gathered because we're going to meet the estranged daughter of uh, one of our friends who's recently deceased. And she shows up, and everything seems normal at first, but all of a sudden, she knows things about us. And okay. she's starting to, to let secrets out that nobody knew in the friend group about. And all of a sudden, we're not sure she says that she is who she says she is. And so, yeah, yeah. And okay. So the tension is building, um, but there's lots of laughs too with all the kind of creepy, twisty stuff. John, with it going across Canada, obviously, you know, there's so many great benefits to that. But as the playwright, you know, you can't be there all the no, time I've to see, the, yeah. you know, to see the production itself. Yeah. What, what, what's that like? What's that? Uh, is it a challenge? Yeah, well, like psychologically, even. Yeah, it's it's like odd that's your baby. Know. I know it's it's it is weird. And when it's you know when it was done in Halifax, I didn't see it. When it was done in Vancouver, I didn't see it. I just went last month to see it in Toronto, and it was fantastic production, sold out houses. So it was wow. re really personally just amazing to sit there and see everyone reacting to it. Uh, I read the reviews, you know, and right. uh, and then you know usually in touch with the director, and they say, oh, it was a great night, and you know, blah blah blah. But, you know, I'm okay not seeing it as well. <laughs> it feels odd, but I, I, I don't know. No, no, I know, know the feeling. I, yeah. You know, I've done some films in the past, yeah. and I don't want to watch it. You don't yeah, want to see just, it, you know. You put a lot yeah. of pressure on yourself, right? Yeah, and I've seen it enough times. Yeah. That, you know, I've lived with it for uh, Carolyn, obviously, you know, I, I've talked to the other guests. You know, the coronavirus, COVID-19, that, uh, you know, has now been called a, a pandemic. Uh, this production is still ongoing. However, I imagine you're, you're probably telling people at home, you know, just make sure you call the box office, visit the website to, to get updates. Yeah, so things are, um, I think, for all of us, a little bit fluid right now. You yeah. know, it, it, the, it seems to be increasing every single day. We do take the, the health and the well-being of our patrons very seriously. Um, we've been in contact with Ottawa Public Health, and right now we are discussing what is going to be the best move for the play, but for our patrons yeah. um, as well. And mm -hmm. so I would say really watch the website, um, ottawalittletheater.com, um, because there will be an announcement made about okay. what's going to happen with the production. John, we have about 30 seconds left, mm -hmm. but I want to mention you're going, you're, this play is going to the Edinburgh uh, Fringe Festival. Yep. This is really exciting yeah, because it's the huge. first OLT play to make it to that festival since mm -hmm. 1949. Mm -hmm. So yeah. much pride in that. I, I am, yeah. And it, uh, yeah, it's, it's amazing. And I unfortunately, I won't be there. <laughs> you will, though. <laughs> yeah. You'll yeah, represent she'll, She's the, in it. The, yeah. she, I hope she does. <laughs> yes, yes. Uh, yeah, but it, it is amazing, yeah. and, uh, you know, so, yeah. Excellent. Well, Thanks, congratulations. Thank you very I much. I can't wait to see it. I'm really Great looking forward you. to it. OttawaLittleTheater.com to find out more information. Give them a call at the box office as well. Hey, we'll be back on Monday. Enjoy your weekend, everybody.